Hey guys, welcome to the first official drawing of three new short story subjects here on 3daystories.com. I will draw three random subjects from Wikipedia and then, yeah, let's see what happens. Maybe I get some ideas, maybe I'll talk about any genres that come to mind. Maybe I'll draw a total blank and embarrass myself. Let's see. Let's get right into it. So we're on Wikipedia and if you don't know this feature, right here on the left side, I hope you can see my mouse button, uh, my mouse pointer, um, we got random article and as far as I know you can't really uh, influence what comes up here. Last time I did it I got three very different things. Uh, I got a subway, uh, I got a railway station, which the first short story you can read is about. I got, um, I think it was some kind of butterfly or something, and yeah, the third one, I forgot, I think it was something to do with baseball or football or something, something really specific. So let's see how my luck fares now. The first try, here we go. Random article and we get Norman Claxton. Let's see who that is. Norman Claxton was an all-round sportsman from South Australia. He was prominent. He was a prominent figure in South South Australian cricket. Australian rules football, baseball, and cycling during the early 20th century, both as a player and later as an administrator. So this guy lived from 1877 to 1951. That could be something. I don't have an idea right now for this kind of person, but well, let's see. Maybe something will come to me. You just saw it. I just dragged down the link into my um, little bar here. And now I'm going to draw the second one. Let's go. Random. And we get the Cleveland Museum of Natural History. So that's a place. A person, not a place. The Cleveland Museum of Natural History is a natural history museum. Surprise. Located approximately five miles east of downtown Cleveland, Ohio, in University Circle, a 550-acre concentration of educational, cultural, and medical institutions. That doesn't sound too exciting, to be honest, but uh, maybe I will see... Well, what's that down here? The Hammond Todd Collection. The Hammond Todd Collection is a collection of more than 3,100 human skeletons and over 900 primate skeletons. That's something. That's something of a... right out of a horror story or something like this. I mean, how did they all get there? Let's find out. I'll just save this onto the... what's the bar called? I don't know. And third try. Random article. Here we go. It's the 2012 Women's Junior European Volleyball Championship. Well, okay. And this championship was played in Ankara, Turkey, from August 18th to August 26, 2012. Turkey won the championship before Serbia and Italy and qualified to the 2013 Women's Junior World Championship. And then we got lots of stats and numbers and playoff uh, tables and whatnot, but not much more information here. Well, you could, of course, place a dramatic figure in this competition, or maybe someone wants to go there. That sounds more like a drama or something. It's all women, so... Yeah, I don't know, maybe some kind of sports drama, something to do with drugs, doping, comes to mind. I don't know. But I do have three days, so I don't have to choose right now. <clears throat> So, summarizing, we have Norman Claxton, the sportsman from South, South Australia. We got the Cleveland Museum of Natural History and we get the bone collection of the humans there. So that's interesting and to be honest that's my favorite right now. And then we get the 2012 Women's Junior European Volleyball Championship. Which in itself is a fantastic title for a short story. 
I must say. No, of course not. So yeah, that's it. I will now take my sweet time and think about what I can do with one of those three and let you know in yeah, three days maximum. Be sure to check out 3daystories.com at least every three days, of course, makes sense. And uh, once they're up, please also join me at Facebook, uh, follow me at Twitter or, of course, since you are watching this video, like or uh, join my YouTube channel. And yeah, come back and have fun. See you next time.